that lady got a husband and seven kids and today i am cooking steak eggs and toast for breakfast i actually was supposed to make this steak for dinner but we ended up eating out so i was like shoot i got this steak in the refrigerator steak and eggs it is i went in at first with some zesty italian dressing man peach patch if you don't season your steak with zesty italian dressing you missing out on a good time and then i added some badia complete your meal ain't complete come on if you don't use complete then i added some zazon and some black pepper that's all i use gave it a real stir put some avocado oil in my pan and then i put the steaks up in a knife I'm not no chef. I'm just a lady that's cooking for her husband and seven kids. But let's not act like a lot of y'all ain't learned how to cook from me during the pandemic. Y'all know y'all was cooking with peach, cooking with peach, cooking with peach. You already know you cooking with me. A lot of y'all learned how to fry mustard fried chicken from me. So y'all know when it come to meat, I get down i don't play all right so i went ahead and let it brown up on one side and then i flipped it up and we like our steak well in our family because we bigger bigger black y'all y'all we bigger the bigger the black y'all so we like raised up to eat our steak well gregory mckay will eat a medium well sometimes i will as well but today we make sure they're well done i cut up some onions i was trying to be puerto rican yeah i'm a puerto rican and then i put them in my same little marinade that I made and then I threw them up in my pan like so and we gonna let them onions get brown which I call it caramelizing yeah peach batch I could already tell it's about to be a good time and I just want to tell y'all no matter what you're going through keep going what they say tough times don't last forever tough people do you gonna shake back keep your head in the game I know it's hard I know you might want to stay in the bed and cry but bitch get up you got to get up. You got to keep going. You got kids depending on you. If you quit, then they lose. Let me say that again. If you quit, your kids lose. And I know you ain't raising a whole bunch of motherfucking losers. So get up. Now we going in with the eggs. I put some butter in the pan. I season my eggs with salt and pepper. And I'm going to add some Kraft American cheese because that's what I like. Oh, you like that, huh, huh? That's what I like. I feel like can't nobody make better eggs than me. Like, put a thousand dollars up. I promise you, I'll win. The trick to making the perfect egg scramble is just to stir, stir, stir. Don't let them get brown, just stir, stir, stir. I want them moist a little bit, runny. Stir, 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 stir. So, keep going, keep going. <laughs> yeah, better than Waffle House. All right, after that, I got a plate so I can make my husband plate first. I don't care how much money I make, I'm always gonna make my husband plate first that's just a peach mac type thing i don't care who get me after that i grabbed him two pieces of steak and put on his plate made sure i included the onions because we actually like onions in this family even the kids i made him some toast put some butter on both sides baby and then i gave it to him after that i made phenomenal plate he was